French President Emmanuel Macron held an emergency cybersecurity meeting Thursday to weigh possible government action after reports that his cell phone and those of government ministers may have been targeted by spyware. Here's a summary of the article. French President Emmanuel Macron held an emergency cybersecurity meeting Thursday to weigh possible government action after reports that his cell phone and those of government ministers may have been targeted by spyware. Macron changes his phones regularly and is taking the matter very seriously, government spokesman Gabriel Attal said Thursday on France Inter Radio. A global media consortium reported this week that Pegasus spyware made by Israeli company NSO Group may have been used to target politicians, activists and journalists in several countries. French newspaper Le Monde, a member of the consortium, reported that a Moroccan security agency had the cell phones of Macron and 15 then-members of the French government on a list of potential targets of the spyware in 2019. Investigations are underway to determine whether the spyware was actually installed on the phones or whether data was retrieved, Adel said. He stressed the importance of broader cybersecurity efforts to protect public facilities, such as hospitals, that have been targeted by malicious software in the past. An official with NSO, Chaim Gelfand, told Israel-based I-24 News on Wednesday that Macron was not a target. This post received a score of 1600, with an upvote ratio of 97%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. The espionage software Pegasus can remotely track and extract sensitive data from a phone. Pegasus gives itself access to everything on an iPhone or Android device. The software has access to cloud storage and is able to even gain access to data outside the phone. All data is sent via Wi-Fi or mobile data to an anonymized command, control server and stored there for analysis. Holy fuck. Nouveau téléphone. Qui dis? Ja 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 at la meme. This isn't Brazil. The proper laugh is hon hon hen. Ja 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 isn't used in Brazil either. It's ha 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 or rsrsrs or kkkk or hue 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 or wa 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 krkskakf hawakakix. 555 in Thailand. The number 5 is pronounced ha. Didn't the U.S. Security Service hack several European leaders' telephones a few years back? Yup. And a whole lot of nothing happened. If this is the Israeli software, a whole lot of nothing will happen too. If it's Russian or Chinese spyware, they'll wag their finger then a whole lot of nothing will happen. He should call the Israeli government and tell him to go and fuck themselves. No need to call. Just say it within microphone distance of his phone. They'll get the message. That is the smartest thing I heard today. So what did he announce at that meeting? Not clicking the clickbait article. New phone. Who dis? This used to be a conspiracy theory. They're always crazy conspiracy theories until they're proven true. Then it becomes something everyone always knew about. And you know what we never get? An apology. When you know how to do these things while it's still considered a conspiracy, you're labeled a pessimistic asshole. Once it comes to light it's true, very possible, and already happened. There's never a, I'm sorry, you were right. I always feel like, somebody's watching me. I wonder not only what information Pegasus picked up, but if it will eventually be released to the public. Only if it can be used to harm political opponents. I'm sure governments like Modi's have collected tons of information about political opponents that he can use for blackmail. It's interesting that there's so many cyber attacks affecting different countries recently. I'd be looking right at Mike Pompeo's fat fucking face for the answers. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.